morning. Today I have an intermediate level core flow yoga class for you. Our peak poses will be crane pose and one-legged crow. If you have a yoga block, please grab that now and we'll move it off to the side. Legs long, arms by our side, palms facing up, toes flopping open, soften the belly, take a big breath in through the nose, big sigh out through the mouth, and then seal the lips. And take a few moments here to simply bring your attention to your breath. Another big breath in through the nose, big sigh out through the mouth, and please take a moment to set an intention for your practice. Take a full body stretch, reaching arms one way, feet the opposite way, and release. Bend the knees, draw them in towards you, give yourself a gentle squeeze and find a bit of rocking. And then come to stillness. Reach for your block and put it between the thighs. Let's stack the knees over hips, shins parallel to the floor. Draw the low abs in and press your low back firmly into the mat. Keep it there. Hands the thighs. Push the thighs away, but resist the thighs back into the hands. Keep drawing the abs in. Keep pressing low back into the mat. Tune back into your breath. Couple more breaths. And 
soften, draw the knees in, big breath in, big breath out. Keep your block there. Again, knees over hips, shins parallel to the mat, arms up to the side, and let's float the knees part way right. Come back through center and float them part way left and keep switching. Next time you go right, lower knees all the way, and pause there a few breaths. back to center. Take the block out, pull it in the hands. Open the knees up. Feel the shoulders up off the mat, tuck the chin slightly, and scoop the abs like you did earlier. Place the block between your feet, that's your inhale, and exhale, extend your arms and legs. Inhale, take the block back, and exhale, extend, really scooping out those abs every time you extend. Last one. And then head and shoulders down, knees into the chest, big belly breath. And place the block again between the thighs, knees over hips, shins parallel to the floor, arms out the side. Let's go back to our twist, floating the knees partly left first this time, back through center, and then float the knees partly right. And keep switching. And the next time you go left, lower knees all the way and pause there a few breaths. center. Take the block out. Again, hold it in the hands and open up the knees. Peel the shoulders up. Tuck the chin. Scoop the abs. Inhale. Place the block between your feet. Exhale. Extend arms and legs. Scooping out the abs. Inhale. Take it back. And exhale. Extend. And keep passing the block back and forth. Here. Last one. And head and shoulders down, knees into the chest. Big breath in. And out. Move the block off the side, place the feet on the ground, let the feet come together, let the knees go wide, recline bound angle, pausing here a few breaths. Just place your hands wherever they're comfortable.
Close the knees up, hug the knees in. Open the knees up. And reach towards the inside of the legs. Wrap your hands on the outside of the feet. Find happy baby. Draw the knees in and then rock yourself up to your seat. Let's bring ourselves to all fours, tabletop. Hands under the shoulders, knees under the hips. Inhale, lift the tailbone, lift the heart. And exhale, round the spine. Inhale, lift. And exhale, round. Three more times. Last one. And bring the spine back to neutral. Walk the hands forward, curl the toes under, lift the knees and hips, and find downward facing dog. Forward high plank and hold here. And lower to the forearm, forearm plank, hold here. to Sphinx Pose. And lower the chest. Float the hands beside the hips or interlace them behind you. Lift the chest whole. under the shoulders, knees down, press up and back, extended child's pose. <clears throat> back to downward facing dog. closer and feet out a bit wider. Keep your right hand down. Let's see if we can pick up the left hand and bring it behind us and hold here. Three, two, one. Place the left hand down. Pick up the right hand. Bring it behind you. Hold here. Three, two, one. Lower the right hand. Take the hands back to shoulder distance apart. Feet back to hip distance apart. Lower the forearms. Forearm plank. And let's pick up the left toes 
and then place the left toes to the back of the right heel. Hold here. Three, two, one, left toes down and pick up the right foot, place the right foot to the back of the left heel, hold here. Three, two, one, right foot down, lower the knees, lower the hips, back to Sphinx pose. Chest, float the hands or interlace them behind you, lift and hold. And release hands under the shoulders, knees down. Press up and back, extended child's pose. And downward facing dog. Walk your feet towards your hands. Halfway lift, inhale, extend the chest, and exhale, fold, heel toe the feet apart, turn the toes out, bend the knees, deep squat pose. Heel to the feet in, halfway lift, inhale, and exhale, fold, bend the knees, rag, roll yourself all the way up to standing, and roll the shoulders up, back and down, arms by your side. Reach the arms up, inhale, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, extend the chest, and exhale, fold, inhale, reverse, swan dive, all the way up. Exhale, hands to, heart center. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, extend the chest, and exhale, fold. Inhale, reverse, swan dive, all the way up. And exhale, hands to heart center. One more like that, reach up, inhale. And exhale, fold. Inhale, extend. And exhale, fold. Inhale, reverse, swan dive, all the way up. And exhale, hands to heart center. Reach up again, inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, extend. And exhale, step the right foot back and then the left, high plank, lower all the way down. Three cobras, inhale, lift, and exhale, lower. Inhale, lift, and exhale, lower. Last one, inhale, lift, and exhale, lower, push up, high plank, and back to downward facing dog. Lift the heels, bend the knees, look forward, step or hop forward. Halfway lift, inhale, and exhale, fold, inhale, reverse, swan dive, all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Reach up, inhale. Exhale, fold. Inhale, extend. Exhale, fold, step the left foot back and then the right. And lower all the way down. Inhale, cobra. And exhale, lower. Two more. Inhale, cobra. And exhale, lower. Inhale, lift. And exhale, lower, push up. High plank, downward facing dog. Lift the heels, bend the knees, look forward, and step hop forward. Half foot lift, inhale. Exhale, fold, inhale, reverse, swan back, oh, lift. Exhale, hands to your heart center. Reach up, inhale. 
Exhale, fold. Inhale, extend the chest. And exhale, fold. Step the right foot back and then the left. Ripple forward onto the tips of the toes, knees up or down. Chaturanga, hold. Five, four, three, two, one. Up dog, hold. Five, four, three, two, one. Hips up and back. Downward facing dog. With the heels, bend the knees, look forward, and bring it forward. Half foot lift, inhale, and exhale, fold, inhale, rise. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, extend. And exhale, fold, step the left foot back, and then the right. Ripple forward onto the tips of the toes, tread around the hole, ten. Three, two, one. Inhale, up dog. Hold here for ten. Three, two, one. Hips up and back. Downward facing dog. Heels, bend the knees, look forward, and step the hop forward. Half foot lift, inhale, and exhale, fold. Inhale, reverse swan dive. All the way up, and exhale, hands to heart center, arms by side. Big breath in, and out. Reach up, inhale, bend the knees, exhale, chair pose, hold. Extend the chest and exhale, fold, step left foot back, lower left knee. Reach up, circle the arms back, open up the chest, and maybe interlace the fingers behind you. Hands to either side of the front foot and begin to extend the right leg towards straight. Bring a bend back to the right knee, hands under the shoulders, lift the back knee, three-legged dog, right leg to the sky, inhale. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, contract. Three more. Stretch the leg high, knee to nose, hold. Five, three, two, one. Inhale, extend. And exhale, step the foot through. Deep hip distance apart, high lunge, reach up. And then hinge forward at the hips and float the torso above the front thigh. Keep stretching those fingers forward, hold here. down, step back, high plank, lower all the way down. Extend left arm forward, bend right knee. Reach back with right hand, grab the foot and kick up. And release. Extend the leg long, hands under the shoulders, take it to cobra, release, 
push up, high plank, downward facing dog. Lift the heel, bend the knees, look forward and bring it forward. Halfway lift, inhale, and exhale, fold, inhale, rise. Exhale, hands to heart center, arms by side, big breath in. And out. Reach up, inhale. Chair pose, exhale, hold and breathe. Extend the chest and exhale, fold. Step the right foot back, lower the right knee. Reach up, circle the arms back, open up the chest, and maybe interlace the fingers behind you. And release the hands. Work left leg towards straight. And bring it in to the left knee, hands under the shoulders, lift the right knee, three-legged dog, left foot to the sky, inhale, exhale, knee to nose around the spine. Inhale, extend, exhale, contract, three more. Stretch the leg up, knee to nose, hold, five, four, three, two, one, inhale, extend, and exhale, step the foot through. Feet hip distance apart. High lunge, reach up. Hinge forward at the hips. Float the torso above the front thigh and keep stretching fingers forward. down, step back, high plank, lower all the way down. Extend right arm forward and bend left knee, reach back, grab the foot and kick up. And release, leg long, hands under shoulders, inhale, cobra, exhale, push up, high plank, downward facing dog. Extend right leg to the sky, inhale. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee right arm, see if you can touch it. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee left arm, see if you can touch it. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee right arm and hold. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee. Left arm and hold. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee. Right arm and hold for ten. Three, two, one. Inhale, extend. 
Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee, left arm high. Hold. Ten. Three. Two, one. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend and exhale. Step the foot between the hands. Spin the back foot flat. Warrior two and rise. Bring the left hand behind you, keep it at the base of the spine, maybe reach for right thigh. Flip the right palm, reach up and back, maybe hand to the base of the skull, and lean back, opening up the chest. Release the arms and work the right leg towards straight. Reach arms up. Let's hook the thumbs, palms facing away from you. And then begin to send the left hip towards the left and hinge over towards the right leg. Keep drawing left hip back, left shoulder back. And back into the right knee. Take the right arm underneath the left, wrapping once or twice your shoulders. Inhale, reach up and back. Exhale, dive forward. Stay low, unravel the arms, hands to either side of the front foot, lift the back heel, right foot to the sky, three legged like dog, bend the right knee and open up the right hip for a couple breaths. Step the right foot to the outside of the right hand, lizard pose, staying on hands, maybe lowering to forearms, back knee down or up. And then start to walk the feet in, dolphin pose. And lift the arms up, downward facing dog. Walk your hands back towards your feet. Half breath, inhale, exhale, fold, peel to the feet apart. Let's take it back to deep squat pose, couple breaths. And then hands to the mat, we're going to try first round of crow pose. For this variation, we're going to lift the hips up a little, keep the feet wide and maybe even hands slightly wider than the shoulders. We are going to take the knees to the outsides of the arms for this version, and then squeeze the arms using the inner thigh. And see if you can lean forward and de-weight the toes, holding here.
for another 10. Three, two, one, back to deep squat pose. Hands to the mat, lift the hips up, heel to the feet in, half finished inhale, and exhale fold. Inhale, reverse one dive all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart center, on the side side, pause. Let's turn around to face the other way. Roll the shoulders up, back and down, hands behind the hips, anchor hips forward, lift the chest, lean back, few breaths here. And release, interlace hands behind you, open up the chest, dive over your legs. And release the hands, half foot lift, inhale, exhale, fold, step or hop back, plank or chaturanga, and flow through. Left leg to the sky, inhale. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee left arm. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee right arm. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee left arm, hold. Five, three, two, one. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee right arm, hold. Five, three, two, one. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee left arm, hold for ten. Three, two, one. Inhale, extend. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend, exhale, knee, right arm, hold, 10. Three, two, one. Inhale, extend, exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend, and exhale, step the foot through. Spin the back foot flat, warrior two, left side. Let's take the right hand behind us, keep it at the base of the spine, maybe reach for left thigh. Flip the left palm, reach up and back, maybe hand at the base of the skull, lean back, open up the chest. Let's work that left leg towards straight. Reach up, let's hook the thumbs, push hip towards the right, and then hinge over towards the left. Hold and breathe. Right hip, right shoulder drawing back. to warrior two. Take the left arm underneath the right, wrapping once or twice, so shoulders, inhale, lean back, exhale, dive forward. Stay low, unravel the arms, hands to either side of the front foot. Lift the right heel, left foot. 
three-legged dog, bend the left knee and open up the hip. And back to forearm plank, hold here. I'm going to start to walk the feet in, back to dolphin pose. back towards the feet. Half a minute inhale and exhale fold heels to the feet apart. Let's take it back to deep squat pose a couple breaths. And then hands to the mat. Second round of crow pose. Lift the hips up. For this one let's bring the feet together to touch and then lift the heels. With the hands shoulder distance apart. Nestle the knees to the backs of the triceps. Look just past the fingertips, lean forward, creating that shelf in your arms so you can deweight the feet and using your abs, lift the heels up off the mat. Hold here. For another 10. Three, two, one. Feet down, back to deep squat pose. Mat lift, the hips up, heel to the feet in, half foot lift, inhale, exhale, fold, inhale, reverse, one dive, all the way up. Exhale, hands to, heart center, arms by your side, pause. Let's turn around to face the other way. Roll the shoulders up, back and down, hands behind the hips, lift the chest, lean back. And release. Interlace hands behind you. Open up the chest. Dive over your legs. And release the hands. Half foot lift. Inhale. Exhale. Fold. Step or hop back. And flow through. Start to walk the feet forward and the hands back so they meet in the middle. Half foot lift, inhale, and exhale, fold. Heel to the feet apart, turn the toes out back to deep squat pose. Hands to the mat. Lift the hips up. Again, heel to the feet together to touch like we did for the second variation. Hands shoulder distance apart, spread the fingers wide. Lift the heels. Take the knees as high up the arms as possible. Press the knees to the backs of the arms. Lean forward. Claw the mat and see if you can lift the feet up. And maybe for this variation, you're working the arms towards straight for crane. Four, ten. Three, two, and one. Feet down. Deep squat pose. Hands to the mat, lift the hips up, heel to the feet in, half foot lift, inhale, 
And exhale, fold, inhale, reverse, one by all. Exhale, hands to your heart, center, arms by your side, pause. Let's roll the shoulders up, back and down. And hands behind the hips again, lift the chest, lean back. Maybe this time you're reaching for the backs of the thighs. And then really anchor those hips forward, begin to lean back, walking fingers back towards the knees. Pause at the top. Reach up, inhale, and exhale, forward fold. Inhale, extend, and exhale, fold. Let's bend the knees enough that we can lift up the feet and slide our whole hand under each foot. Right hand under right, left hand under left foot. See if you can line the toes right up with the wrist crease. And then begin to pull the hips up to the sky, pull the head down towards the mat, and press chest back towards your thigh as you simultaneously press the toes into the backs of the wrists. chest forward, release the hands, and then fold forward. And then begin to bend the knees, bend the knees, bend the knees, until you can sit down. Let's grab our block again. Come to the middle of the mat, unless you're already there. Put the block between the thighs. Grab the backs of the thighs, lift the feet, bring shins parallel to the floor. And you can move from here if you like, you can move from here, or maybe with arms and legs extended. V sets, we're gonna lower, low boat, inhale, exhale, pull up. Inhale down, exhale, pull up. Ten more. a big squeeze, take a big breath in, and out. Okay, one-legged pro. Come to all fours. Curl the toes under, and then lift the knees. Step the right foot forward, and left foot a little bit further back. Bring the right knee to the back of the right arm, but this time, closer to the elbow. Give it some pressure, lean forward, start to create a shelf with your arms, and then lift the right toes. And then see if you can hit, shift forward and lift the left foot off the mat for 10. Three, two, one. Release. Sitting up tall, big breath in. And out. Grab your block again. Let's go back to the V-sits before we reach out to the other side. Block between the thighs. Hands behind the thighs. Lean back. Lift up the feet, shins up, arms up, maybe legs long, inhale, and exhale, inhale, exhale. Take the left 
knees the back of the left arm, but closer to the elbow, not high up the arm like we did earlier. And then lean forward, creating a shelf with your arms, pick up the left foot, lean forward a bit more, really fire up that core, and see if you can bring the right leg up for 10. Three, two, one. Release. Sitting up nice and tall. Take a big breath in. And out. Okay, let's give our wrists some love. Extend right arm forward, palm facing forward, fingers pointing down. Take your left hand and gently pull on the left fingers. Maybe thumb to the back of the wrist for a little bit more sensation. And then release. Same hand, turn the palm towards you and then bend the elbow out away from you. Let the hand just flop. Take the left hand and gently pull, or sorry, push the back of the wrist. And release. Let's extend left arm forward, palm facing out, fingers pointing down. Use the right hand to pull the fingers back, maybe thumb back of the wrist. And release the same hand. Let the fingers drop down and palm in, point the elbow out, keep the hand nice and loose. Use your right hand to gently push. into fists, keep the shoulders relaxed, and draw circles. And switch direction. And then release the fist gently, shake out the hands. to your lap, another big breath in, and out. Let's make our way onto our backs, knees bent, raise your arms forward, roll all the way back. Once your head and shoulders land, walk the feet in a bit closer until maybe you can just touch the backs of the heels. Bridge pose, rooting down through the feet and hands, lift up, and let's Bring the shoulders underneath us and see if you can interlace the fingers beneath you, pressing the pinky side of the hand into the mat as you lift the hips up towards the sky. Do that one more time. Rooting down to the hands and feet. Lift up. Tuck your shoulders underneath you and try to interlace the fingers beneath you. Release, pause at 
extend the right leg up and then the left. Place your hands wherever they're comfortable. You might like to bend the arms cactus style to open up the shoulders. The feet relaxed. Knees as bent as needed or wanted. Bend the knees, open up the knees, reach towards the insides of the legs, outside the feet. One more happy baby. Draw the knees in, big squeeze, big breath in. And out. Extend the legs long. The feet flop open, arms by your side, palms facing up. Let the shoulders melt back. Soften the belly, soften the back. Just melt into your mat. No more need for effort. 